Hey guys, welcome back. I'm with Kapmas today. We are in the jungle and we're gonna trek to its a waterfall. It's gonna be a day hike. Hopefully we get to get into some fishing action later today. We'll see how it goes. One thing's for sure, it's gonna be an exciting day. So this is a jungle in Hulu Langat, Selangor and the waterfall we are heading to is a Lopo waterfall Aitujun Lopo and it is just in the vicinity of uh, Perkampungan Orang Asli and to be here you can't just come in without a permit you need a permit to enter this area and the permit can be obtained from the Selangor Forest Department, the Patan Hutan Selangor, and I think it's uh, five ringgit per entry per person. Oh, it's a bit of a climb now. Daun ni? Daun bumban. Daun bumban. So we're just collecting some leaves along the way. We're hoping to get some banana leaves and this is daun bumban. It's supposed to be good for cooking as well. Yep. Berapa jauh lagi kat Mas? Forty to fifty minutes. Deer and tree. This is a really old and tall deer and tree. Are there? The unborn child. <laughs> Wow, Kak Mas. Jumpa dah. Gila, 12 ringgit. Banyak. Banyak. We are currently passing through a farm. A kebun. Ini tempat orang asli kan, Kak Mas? Hmm. Belongs to the orang asli. Passing by. Tempang lalu, tempang lalu. It's a very beautiful little hut. 
It is a moderate level track through a farm and then a jungle, a total distance of 6.8 kilometers in and out, with an elevation gain of over 400 meters, and may take anything between two to four hours one way, depending on your pace. This bunga kantan. This is a bunga kantan plant. This is the leaf. Mmm, very fragrant. We are in the forest and you can immediately feel the freshness of the air here. Sound of water in the distance, and not a very far distance. While Kak Mas was whipping up a quick snack, I decided to take a sneak peek of the underwater situation.
clear and pristine waters and lots and lots of fish. After filling up our tummies, we were ready to fish. As a fishing newbie, I didn't really know what to do. But thankfully, I had a trusted friend to guide me through. It took me a while to get the hang of the basics. I was mainly just casting, casting again, and again, and again, and again. Still got nothing. So I decided to change my spot and try again. This time making sure I was hiding behind the rocks to be less visible to the fish. After some time, not sure if the fish have gone for an afternoon nap or we have scared them off. There was just no more bite. So we got two. Well actually we got three but one slipped off my hand back into the water. So yeah, we're left with two. Um, I mean, not bad. Wish we could go on but it's already 5 p.m. now and we gotta get going. Initially planned to keep the fish here but we 
ran out of time. So I guess we're gonna get going, pack up and leave, and hopefully get back before it gets dark. I'm going at a slightly fast pace now because it's 5.30 in the evening and hopefully we get to get back to base camp or the trailhead by 6.30 We'll see if we're going to cook the fish there Alright, it's been such a beautiful day Totally enjoyed this hike I think spending half a day in this jungle has been so therapeutic i feel so great now had a good sweat and the waterfall the waterfall was absolutely beautiful and we enjoyed our little fishing session as well so yeah i guess i'll end the video here uh, thank you guys for watching all the way till the end as usual if you like what you see don't forget to hit like as it really helps the channel grow so yeah i'll see you in the next video bye bye Look at that! Just fallen, I think. Tengok isi dia okey ke tak? Uran Buka. Oh! Wow! Okay. Okay lah. Good lah. Masih boleh. Wow, how lucky are we? Stumbled upon a durian just like that. Yes, big one. Yay! Hmm. Stop. Good, good. <laughs> wow. Hmm. <laughs> So we got back to the trailhead just before dark and found a cooking spot to enjoy our catch. <laughs>